Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. About 36 hours after Pikeville Police Officer Scotty Hamilton was gunned down in the line of duty, the man believed to have been the one that pulled the trigger was taken into police custody. Go to hell. You, 55-year-old John Russell Hall was arrested at approximately 11 a.m. Thursday in Pike Floyd Hollow at Betsy Lane. Kentucky State Police Post 9 Captain Donnie Shearer said Hall was taken into custody without incident. Kentucky State Police, uh, following some information they received, were able to locate John R. Hall at a residence off the of uh, Stony Brook in the Betsy Lane area of, uh, of Pike County. It was, uh, it was actually just inside Pike County where it happened at. Uh, he was taken, Mr. Hall was taken into, into custody without incident. Without and charged him at that time with possession of a handgun by a convicted felon. Hall was transported to the Pikeville Police Post uh, during that time, additional investigative leads were followed up on, which led to Mr. Hall being charged with one count of murder involving a police officer. Hall had been on the run since Hamilton, a 12-year veteran of the Pikeville Police Department, was shot and killed at Hurricane Creek in Pike County. A massive manhunt ensued and culminated in Hall's capture, which was caught on video by a Pike Floyd Hollow resident Thursday morning. Rest in peace, Scotty. They got him. We have the best cops ever. And now for the police officers who have been looking for Hall. Relief. Well, it's definitely a relief for, uh, for all of us, and I'm sure definitely with the Pikeville Police Department as well as everybody in the community. Um, you know, we wish this, this had never happened, but uh, it's definitely a feeling of relief for all of us. Several people were arrested with Hall, but none of those arrests were in relation to Officer Hamilton's death. There were other people arrested at the scene on unrelated charges that were not, not related to the death of Officer Hamilton. Captain Shearer said numerous agencies took part in the search for Hall and the investigation following Hamilton's death. Officer Scotty Hamilton leaves behind a wife and a nine-month-old baby girl. He was 35 years old. Reporting in Pikeville, Chris Anderson, EKB News. B News.